Hi everyone, so let's see what's up, um, what the romance angels have to tell you. If you guys do want to book a reading with me or do any spell work, candle work, um, $5 cash app questions, I will be leaving my cash app so you guys can hit me up. My readings are going to be in the description down below. My $5 cash app questions are same day, so you purchase them same day, but my readings you do have to wait three to five business days. So let's see. We got worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. So maybe everyone around you is extremely um, taken and you're single as a Pringle and you're just like, what the hell? <laughs> you're like, why not me? I've done this. I've done that. Okay. Let it unfold naturally, right? It's always best when you've worked for it, when you've healed from it, right? You don't want to meet someone and you have trust issues, abandonment issues, daddy issues. You're crying in their face and they're just like, what the hell? And then you let a good man walk away. I'm kind of getting the energy of Big and Carrie from Sex and the City. If you guys have not watched it, watch it. I am a, I'm binging it right now, you guys. I'm binging it right now. And I've always, I've watched it before, but I'm binging it again. And, you know, when Carrie gets with Aiden and she's, like, not ready for commitment and she wishes that Big acted like that and Big did all this and Big did all that, but she has a good man in front of her and she's acting like Big, don't be like that. Don't be like that. <laughs> yeah, and it's safe for you guys to love. Excuse my nails, you guys. My nail girl is booked and busy and I've been really busy. I haven't had time. So, yeah, open your heart. Make time. Make the effort for you to find love, for you to, like, go out and meet people don't be so stuck up and in your feels over you not being able like you not wanting to get hurt right you could be meeting someone over the summer um during a holiday and then maybe you guys are gonna go on a trip together you guys are gonna be having a lot of heart-to-heart -heart conversations too like you're gonna be telling them like hey like i don't want this i don't like that like you and this person are gonna have that connection that they're gonna know um what you want and what you don't want and you're gonna know as well which is gonna make the relationship um be long-term, lead to commitment, lead to marriage, lead to kids, lead to moving in, right? And I feel like kids could be kind of affecting your love life right now. Maybe you have kids, maybe they'll have kids, maybe you guys both have kids, or you guys don't want kids at all. This is a conversation that you guys will have regardless if you have kids, if they have kids, your guys' family will combine like, like nothing. Everybody will get along. Everybody will get along is what I'm hearing. Yeah, and I feel like you're gonna have heavy romantic feelings. Um, and I feel like, honestly, you, you're healing a lot of family issues right now, especially with this eclipse, this pink moon that just passed, retrograde. It stirred, off, it stirred up a lot of um, emotions, a lot of, um, like, old emotions. I'm, I'm, I was getting, like, daddy issues, mommy issues, parents, divorcing, um, past traumas, PTSD of, like, this person did me wrong, I remember this, I remember that, kind of, like, uh, a lot of triggers happen right now and I feel like you're healing a lot of inner child healing right now um kind of taking care of yourself is what I'm hearing you're taking care of yourself for sure a lot a lot of taking care of yourself and this isn't for sure but your soulmate you're gonna be like questioning like is this my soulmate is this who I'm supposed to be with is this the one should I stay should I go like the universe is gonna be guiding you into the same direction and you guys are gonna meet in the middle and I feel like there's going to be a lot of chemistry, like a lot of passion, a lot of chemistry. You guys are going to be getting to know each other for sure. You guys are going to be flirting, going out. There's going to be a lot of, lot of, um, a lot of envy, though. I feel like a lot of people are going to be envious that you're moving on. I'm getting like past lovers or even family, baby daddy, baby mama type of energy is going to be trying to sabotage it and ruin it. Protect your energy. Keep your relationship in hush for now. Um, and I feel like everything will be okay. So that's all I have for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy. If you guys do want to book a reading with me, lizzytaro1010 at gmail.com. Don't forget to check out the description down below. And I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.